Hey there, Earth Signs. I hope you had a great week. It is time for your weekly reading, so if you are Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn, it is your turn. Now, if this is the first time you're joining me, please don't forget that not all messages are going to resonate, and that is okay. If you need a personal reading, give me a shout on my website, kellyfergusonreadings.com. And if you like this message and this reading, please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe so I can continue to do weekly readings for all of you. Okay, my earth signs, I think it's time to take a look and see what June is going to bring. So interesting. I can't believe that we're already doing a reading for June. I don't know how that works, but it is upon us. Holy cow. All right, earth signs, please. What's the overall energies? Okay, there it is. Just jumping right out. Oh, wow. Wise one. I love this card. Wise one, grow within your current situation. Check this out. I love it when the wingeds come out. This card always talks about clairvoyance and also wisdom, knowledge, and discernment. Knowing and seeing ahead, it is about understanding the situation without necessarily being told. So very intuition, intuitive messages coming here for you about using your intuition. And also positive change and transformation, of course, because sometimes not all the facts are thrown in front of you. Sometimes you get to use the tidbits of information and the little intuitive gut feelings for these big changes. Okay. Combining this, combining this, and a little bit of magic. Okay, cool. So let's go into more detail for you earth signs here. Okay, so these are already jumping out of the pack. Woo! All right, dawn and new beginnings is jumping right out for you, earth signs. What are you starting or what are you thinking about starting? Hmm, okay, cool. Green man and synergy. So what's getting in the way? Hold on. Hmm, with this wise one. You know, are you having a difficult time getting something started? Um, okay. This is, with Dawn and Green Man and Synergy showing up, this is making me feel in terms of the challenge that things aren't exactly going your way. I know that you started something recently, Earth Signs, and that you've been moving forward with momentum, you've really been working hard, but have you come up with some, up to some snags? Okay, all right, what's going on? What's the focus? What are we, okay, Lake and Stillness. All right, Earth Signs. You know, Is there some outside interference going on here, Earth Signs? Because I feel like with Lake and Stillness in your foundation here, that you are doing all that you can do. I feel like you've researched, I feel like you've looked at the details, I feel like you've really prepared yourself in the best way possible. I'm getting just this feeling that either there's there's an outside influence or you're listening to someone else's opinion and not following your own gut. It's just this feeling that I'm getting alongside of this card. Are you allowing someone else's opinion to not let you move forward in the way that you wanna go? Because I see this boat parked at the dock here, right? See that? Everything's calm and lovely, but no movement and I do feel that this is either someone talking in your ear and putting fear-based energy in you of, ooh, didn't think about that. Ooh, maybe I shouldn't do that kind of stuff. I feel like you're ready, but it, there's this nervous piece that's holding you back here, Earth Signs. Okay, any insight on this, please? Fog and veiled. Nope. So... <laughs> You gotta love it, right? You gotta love it when the universe does that. Tell us more. No, I'm not gonna show you. So what this also does tell you at the end of the, and this is coming in the past, by the way, this is showing me that as you kind of move forward, even though you're planning and all of this, you didn't exactly know where this was going to go. You didn't know exactly how it was going to work out. There was a little bit of guesswork here. There was a little bit of faith and trust work as well. But now that you've kind of climbed to this mountain without seeing where you were going and you kind of have some light here makes me feel that you're either holding back or again like I'm saying some last minute some either people talking in your ear and trying to convince you to not do so or doubting yourself I'm getting this I keep on getting this energy about an external person talking to you being like the negative Nancy and I'm also getting a message that for some of you, this could be competition. Meaning, for example, sometimes when you start new things and you move forward and you're finding success, not everybody is happy for you, unfortunately. And it's sometimes possible that some people sabotage each other because they're jealous or because they are scared that they're not doing as well themselves. And so therefore it's easier to tear someone down or to hold someone else back than it is to look at what you're doing in yourself. I don't feel that's you or certain. I feel that someone else is holding you back or making you think twice so that being said where do our earth signs have to put their own mind mm, tsunami and wake-up call okay uh, yeah 
So this, <laughs> earth signs, this is telling you that everything that you've worked for, everything that you've moved forward with and worked hard for, it could not go the way you want if you don't keep control of what you got going on right here, your direction. This talks about being emotionally overwhelmed, not being able to see what the next chapter is, having way too much stress, way too much emotional anxiety, okay? And like I said, I feel that you were very strong and building on some strong foundations for yourself, but I feel that this is someone else that's making you feel emotional or bringing up other things that make you go back to a place of feeling insecure. You're not insecure earth signs you've done so many amazing things and I, I see it in these past readings as well we're starting from non, in dawn and new beginnings you already started making headway don't let people make you feel heavy if people start bringing the drama your job is to remember stay calm stay focused I know how I got here I know what I want don't let them shake you earth signs okay what's the preview what are we gonna expect to see in the next little while here clouds and shape shifting I love this so when there's a storm what do you do you adapt you shape shift you need to be able to run with the tide and change in the minute so with some of these people who are giving you a hard time or some of these um, challenges that are coming your way that's making it hard for you to get your traction this card is saying you might just have to switch it up a little bit also don't forget that because I know you're really focused on this or sign sometimes you also need to take a break okay taking a break sometimes can be the best thing for you because it helps you to calm the mind helps you to come back and kind of refocus on what you're doing I just get a piece of that with you or signs that coming forward you're gonna have to <sighs> okay that came up for another sign as well, some breath work, okay? So definitely pay attention to that as well. Are there any other messages here for our earth signs that are gonna let us know what is gonna happen by the end of the month with all of this? A little bit of, well, a little bit of frustration here. Well, that's nice. Shaman, ancient healing wisdom. So what this tells me is that you are either going to be healed and kind of come full circle from this negativity that's being shown up in your way. This is telling you when you follow the light, then my friends, you go in the direction that you want to go instead of being stuck under this heavy wave of density, okay? Ancient healing wisdom also asks you to look within yourself. Again, coming back to you, what do you want? What makes you happy? In it's now an independent game and it is up to you to make yourself happy earth signs. You don't have to hold on to someone else's negativity. You can cut it out, my friends. Earth signs, I wish you the best of luck. I know that you've come a long way. This might seem like a month where you have to buckle down and maybe kind of clear some negativity off of your path, but it's gonna be so worth it. You've already set up so much good stuff for yourself. Keep going, it will pay off. If you like this reading and these messages, please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe so I can continue to do readings for all of you. And if you need a private reading, please don't forget to contact me at my website, kellyfergusonreadings.com. Join me again for another reading, friends.